Hello everyone, welcome back to RLL Studio. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can install fresh animations with Sodium for 1.19.4. Recently, it's become a lot easier to install fresh animations for Sodium as uh, there's a new mod that's been released that makes this like so much more simpler. Um, though, I do have to say, the original method uh, in my previous fresh animations tutorial video still does work, so... Um, you can still use that as well and in some instances that is the only thing that you can do still so um yeah that old video that i posted is still useful so go ahead and check that out um afterwards if you still can't get it to work with that said let's get on with the video just like the last video i'm not really going to show you how to install fabric uh, i'm just going to show you how to install fresh animations i'm going to assume that you already know how to install fabric as you most likely already have sodium if you're clicking on this video. To get fresh animations to work, you're going to need three files, Entity Model Features, Entity Texture Features, and the Fresh Animations Resource Pack. I'll put the links to all of these in the description below. But to start, you're going to want to find your .minecraft folder. Now I'm using a custom launcher, and you might be using one too. That kind of depends on what launcher you're using, where it's stored. So I'm not really going to be able to tell you where your .minecraft folder if you use a custom launcher, but if you're using the vanilla launcher, um, all you have to do is go up into this top bar right here, oh my mouse is off screen, right here, and then type in percentage, app theta, percentage, and I'll put that on screen as well, and uh, you're going to want to uh, go to the .minecraft folder, it should be in there. Once you have the three files that you need installed, you're going to want to drag the two jar files, aka the mods, into your mods folder right here. And you should already have a mods folder if you uh, installed fabric and sodium. And you're going to want to drag them into here. Don't be alarmed by how many mods I have installed. You might have uh, no, no mods installed. You might have a few mods installed. Uh, it all depends on what you have installed, but you're just going to want to drag these two mods into the mods folder and then you're going to want to go to your resource packs folder and drag in the fresh animations dot zip resource pack right here and that is pretty much it it's very simple um and now we can launch the game and see if it works so now that you've launched the game you can go ahead and test to see if fresh animations is working and as you can see everything seems to be working fine Look at that. Yep. Nope. Oh, he's going. Where's the iron golem? Get over here, buddy. Your villagers are dying. He's off guard here. There you go. Get him. Get him. Yep. Oh, he's dead. Yeah, so fresh animations seem to be working fine. I do have a little disclaimer. Uh, if you're trying to get this to work outside of versions 1.19.4 and fabric, uh, such as trying to get it to work for 1.19.2 and on quilt or something like that, it's not going to work. Uh, I've tried it, um, and it's still, like, it, half of the models work. Some of them don't work. Uh, it's going to be really buggy. This works uh, perfectly for 1.19.4 fabric, though. So um, as soon as you try to do something outside of that, it will most likely start breaking. Um, but like I said in the start of the video, uh, my older method, uh, the video that I posted uh, earlier, still does work if you want to try using that. And, um, yeah, so if this doesn't work for you, maybe go to my previous video. I'll put that link in the description as well. Um, so, yeah, anyway, that's going to do it for today's video. I hope you all enjoyed. I hope this helped you guys, and I will catch you in the next one. Goodbye.